Hello my friends, well guys, it's finally time to move to CC8. Well, I've been waiting for a while, I tried my best to get enough resources to upgrade everything that I need to level 16, but here we are, time to do this. We've got a ranger as well, um, nice. I'm going to actually upgrade rangers at some point, I don't know yet. Uh, when I'm going to upgrade the, the car the station bang done nine days so from now on is going to be working on getting loads of uh, munition and gold to upgrade the other things every single thing there let's claim all of those get something back loads of uh, points for the for the battle pass 520 that's quite a lot I'm, I'm quite impressed to be honest with you but that's that, um, we're going to upgrade everything as much as possible now, everything around here, the outpost, then we're going to move into the base, we're going to create a new base, upgrade the walls, upgrade all the structures, it's going to take a while, but we have to do that step by step. Now, my main focus will be, let's see the first CC8 base, as you know, as I... I realized before when you upgrade after that you're going to get a couple of easy battles just to ease you in you know so it's not going to be extremely complicated so this is one of those easy battles we're going to just have a look and after that we're going to try to upgrade um, our commando missile and everything that I need riot and bombing run that's the main four and then after that we are going to focus on the other ones um, such as new units I suppose I am thinking of mercenaries and we see how it goes anyway we're going to create a new squad I know CC8 looks easy now on this battle um, it's not it's going to get more complicated I experienced that in CC7 in CC6 everything uh, at first few battles are easy but that's fine by me because i have to collect as uh, as much munition as possible so from for the next few days is going to be my gameplay is going to be raids 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 upgrades raids 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 upgrade so we're going to get quite a few dog tags this season um, it has to be done everything there as you could see every single structure to upgrade is like 80 or 90 or 70k each that's a lot of munition to get um, upgrading the units as well since I have the resources it's just munition that is missing that will take a while as well um, is is always that question in my head should I upgrade the units first commando and riot or should I upgrade the structures first since the, the structures take time but if I don't upgrade the units I'm going to struggle a little bit getting munition so it's this is my favorite part now this is my favorite part that base was extremely easy as you could see don't worry about it those things are going to change quickly 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 after a few raids but yeah I'm happy with it I've been looking forward to this moment now I'm really really close to level not really close but close enough to level 60 so after upgrading everything there you can see I'm missing only munitions so I'm going to raid 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 and then I'll come back and we're going to do that upgrade together guys here we are we got the munition let's upgrade the commando there we are now again go do raids 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 until we get enough for that but first of all i want to upgrade my missile because in cc8 my missile doesn't destroy things straight away here we are go with the munition let's upgrade the missile and then probably i'm going to go bombing run a little bit later but let's try to find some uh, some lovely fight here we are the first cc9 base again it's one of the easiest ones I'm still at the beginning so I'll show you in the next video guys or a video soon enough what CC9 looks like 
uh, proper bases, nice bases, sniper bases and all of those. In CC9 you get the third tent, the structures look so cool, I can't wait to get there. Uh, but it's no point for me to rush the process since I don't have the setup that I want, I don't have the squad that I want, I don't have resources, I actually struggle getting munition at the moment and all of that. It's no point to go faster and then just stay there and struggle for a long time. It's better taking it easy, collect whatever you have to collect and then uh, move to the next CC. And uh, I'm not saying it's going to be easy, but at least you're not going to struggle a lot. So you can see even the walls in this base, they look absolutely brilliant. I love it. Uh, every single structure. I've seen CC9 bases before, but uh, I, I I still haven't had the chance to attack one that is fully upgraded. This one is upgraded, but it's not fully upgraded. The walls look way better, looks more dangerous. And you can see, guys, how strong the snipers are. I assume those snipers are at least level 16 or 18. Between 16 and 18, you can see they got rid of my riots in seconds. That doesn't happen. That didn't happen in CC7. Uh, my riots would actually tank for a really long time. So this is where the struggle starts a little bit for me, because my units are not strong enough to get rid of all the structures. It's quick enough anyway. Um, if the snipers are shooting, they're going to get to my uh, my veterans. Since once my veterans are gone. It's a uh, game over for me. That's why I need a new squad. I need a new setup for for raids. Um, that's when the mercenaries are going to come into place. We see how it goes. I have an idea. It has to be tested as everything in guns up. Then we see how it goes. We will, it's going to be a video there. I'm going to show you my whole process. Everything I do. So, it's a victory. It wasn't a struggle, I was a little bit at the beginning when all my riots uh, went missing, but that's about it. Well guys, CC8, here I am, but that's everything for this episode, I hope you enjoyed it, if you did, please leave a like, if you can, please share it with your friends, it does help and I do really appreciate it, don't forget to subscribe as well, turn the notification on, and guys, as always, I'll see you next video.